Bashir Humphreys ist im Januar 2023 zum SCP-07 gekommen. Als Leihgabe vom FC Chelsea hat der junge Engländer in Paderborn sofort mit seiner offenen und positiven Art überzeugt. To be honest, I didn't know I had that effect on everyone. I didn't really notice it, but now you're telling me that's a really nice thing to hear. So I hope I have that effect on people, I guess. But yeah, that's really nice. Der Linksfuß entwickelte sich mit seiner Zweikampfstärke und seiner Spielübersicht schnell zum Stammspieler. Um, I think my main strengths come more from me as a character rather than a player. So I feel like on the pitch I I can communicate well with players. I can lead well and I think I bring positive energy to other players and I can help bring the best out of them. And then in terms of myself, I think I'm quite um, a well-rounded player. So in terms of defending, like I'm good defensively and I'm also good on the ball as well. Bei Chelsea hat Humphreys zum ersten Mal in der U15 gespielt. Nach seinem Stipendium gab es 2021 seinen ersten Profivertrag in der höchsten Spielklasse im englischen Fußball. That is a that is a story when I talk about you have to be in the right place at the right time or like luck it really counts because I was uh, playing for a local team in Reading called um, Reading Pumas and my coach there had a link in Chelsea as his son played for Chelsea but at the time I just thought like he was just my friend and then at the end of the season the coach just pulled up to the to the team and he said I've got a few of you trials at Chelsea like out of nowhere we weren't expecting it so I kind of left school went on trial at Chelsea and, and then I just never went back to my school and then I moved to the, the Chelsea school and I moved um, into the digs, the, um, the accommodation. It was like, yeah, it was like one summer, like my life changed. Yeah, it changed completely. So früh bei einem der englischen top clubs unter Vertrag zu stehen, stresst den 20-Jährigen aber nicht. I think the way that I like to look at football is that I can't feel pressure because then it will start to start to impact my game. So I'd rather just take the pressure and know it's there, but then just see every single game as a game of football. It's something I've been doing since I was what, seven, eight years old. Dabei kommt Bash gar nicht aus einer typischen Fußballerfamilie. My family growing up was not a footballing family at all. Yeah, I, as a young child, I didn't like football at all, but my friends. I think it was around the 2010 World Cup. That was when I first fell in love with it. And even then, for maybe for years, my parents haven't really came along to being football fans. They always supported me and they've always given me everything. But then now they're kind of getting a bit more invested. Like my dad will call me and I'll say, did you see this game? Did you see that? And I'm like, oh God, dad, like, come on you with the, with the football terminology, but yeah. Hier in Paderborn kann sich der 20-Jährige ihrer vollen Unterstützung sicher sein. Seine Familie und seine Freunde kleben an den Spieltagen vor dem Fernseher. They're always watching my games, my friends and my my family, but mostly my friends. They're like they're not watching it as friends, they're watching it as analysts. So they always have something to say to me after the game. <lacht> Außerdem ist er gläubig. Bashir betet vor jedem Spiel. Uh, for me, like religion is at the core of everything I do. So it's the thing that kind of like drives me, it um, centers me. It's there in the good and the bad times. So it kind of just keeps me level-headed rather than getting too high when the when things are going well and when things are going bad. I always always just have that that center, and it just helps me to stay cool and just knows helps me to know where I'm headed in life at all times. In Paderborn ist der junge Abwehrspieler mittlerweile gut angekommen und kann es kaum erwarten, mit der Mannschaft noch ein paar Siege einzufahren. I've had so far such a great experience here. Like I felt so welcome and I felt really happy and I feel like I'm really enjoying my football. It's not that I wasn't expecting it to be, but it was like almost more tactical in certain games, like the way we set up and the way the other teams set up and the video analysis. But I don't know if I can attribute that to the league. I think it's just because of the quality of coaching staff we have at Paderborn.